Uh, 10 month old, sick, always sick. Sleep trained at eight months was S-T-T-N. Sleeping through the night. That must be what that means. Context clues. But after sickness, again, um, back to square one. Sleep train again. Had to feed overnight due to diarrhea. Yes. So um, there's lots of challenges to keeping a baby sleep trained and sleeping through the night. Sickness, teething, travel, um, time change, Fourth of July, Christmas, holidays, travel, all those different things that, that interfere. Getting ill is the most common one, and 10-month-olds are almost always sick. And so it is normal to have um, ebbs and flows in the amount of sleep training that we have, and that's totally normal. And yes, usually I would just go back and sleep train again, whether you do a cry-it-out method or you do kind of a gentle, like, camping-style approach. Um, whatever you want. I just noticed that this Sharpie, this is like my house, Sharpie with no lid on it. Definitely dead. Um, what was I saying? Uh, yes, whether you do cried out, camping, whatever style suit training you do, um, just go back and do that again. And you'll just have to do it again. It'll be like spot treatment, so I don't think it'll be very long. It'll just be, you know, a night or two, and then, oh, we used to do this. It's easy to get it once you've got it straightened out. If you haven't sleep trained your baby, if you want to sleep train your baby, I have a course. It's called Mighty Sleepers. If you go to MightySleepers.com, you can find it. If you use code 2020, during the 2020 year, it is 20% off because 2020 sucks, and at least you can get good rest. It works for infants, and then there's a whole new section that we just did for big kids. MightySleepers.com. Use coupon code 2020 so that you can get 20% off, and you'll have a sleep-trained baby within less than a week. You'll have a better sleeping toddler or older child, a big kid, within a week or two. I mean, it does take longer for those big kids because they can knock on the door, they can exit their room, they can come get drinks and all the different things that they require. So it does take a little bit longer, but infants, you can sleep train any infant in a week. You can improve things with a to with a toddler, three-year-old, four-year-old within two weeks and have it much better in a month. So it does take longer. It's not a one night thing for that age group. MightySleepers.com. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, will you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe so you don't miss any future videos that I put out. And if you'd like to learn more or watch another video, you can click right over here to keep going. Have a good day. Keep up the good work.